of the main things that people don't understand about racing is how physically difficult it is. You have to do the gym work to be, you know, to be ready to fully execute the job as a driver. We don't have a lot of time on track during the year. When you think about it, we spend about maybe 15% of the year actually in the race car. So our job outside of the race car is to be physically prepared for when that time comes to, to jump in the race car. I've been coming here since I was like 12. I mean, I was literally here when I was in karting and it's kind of like family here. And, and you know, I trust everyone here, you know, that, that you know, they're doing um, everything they can to help me. And, you know, and in return, you know, it's cool to, you know, work with a lot of professionals. With Connor, it's been really exciting. We've been able to get a lot of great things accomplished. Um, I'm really excited about even, you know, during the course of this season, how much more we can continue to um, really improve and work on this time of year. You know, they're coming off sometimes back-to-back -back weekends of racing. Um, so what we're doing in here uh, is going to be a little bit lower of a volume. Um, and sometimes the intensity will be, you know, relatively high. As a driver, you, you train for all the most physically demanding races, and then if you get a little bit of a breather, you know, at Indy, which is which is nice, you know, on the road course, you feel even more prepared. So that's that's the goal is to obviously be like over prepared for, for a race. Only competitive cyclists have higher sustained heart rates for longer periods of time. So, you know, we are we are constantly pumping that heart, and uh, and, and and it's crazy to think about. We don't train them like bodybuilders or power lifters uh, because it's not about necessarily the weight that they lift or the amount of time that they run, uh, but it's about how doing all those things is gonna make them better inside the car. People just don't really understand the type of forces and the G-forces that the body undergoes. There is no rest. You know, there is no rest for an hour and a half, two hours, you know, however long the races are, and, and, and it's really, really tough. And you have to be absolutely mentally dedicated and physically focused. Every, everything has to be going, and um, you know, that's why we train. I really like the way we go about uh, you know, all of the training that we do here. Um, I think it's, it's, it's incredibly scientific, it's incredibly well thought out, um, and you really feel like you're at the right place. Like that's, that's what I really enjoy about coming here.